I love that you're wearing white right now because it is so hot. Oh, white. that's best though, because the white will reflect off the, yeah, it's perfect. It's perfect. It's unusual. I, we just got back from shooting a, a Good Luck Charlie movie in Salt Lake City, and the fact that the sun is shining is still like tripping me out a little bit. It's so like gloomy and snowy, and there's no green there either. Like, it's all dead. Yeah, so. were, you, were you guys there for um, like skiing at all? Or is it totally not ski season now? No, it, it is. Um, you're not really supposed to when you're shooting a movie. I'm not really a big ski guy anyway, so that wasn't a big temptation for me. Um, but no, we, I mean, we were up there for six weeks, so we had plenty of time. Wow. Yeah. So what's the storyline for this Good Luck Charlie movie you guys are working on? We are all on our way to Palm Springs for a Christmas vacation, and Teddy and Amy get off the flight and they miss the flight. So we're separated and they have to get to Palm Springs and we have to help them get to Palm Springs because they can't get any more flights. And it's, it's got a sort of like plane trains and automobiles kind of a vibe to it. Craziness ensues at all possible corners. Obviously your co-star Bridget Mendler is in this movie Lemonade Mouth, which we're supporting today. Yes. What's something you can tell us about her that maybe we all don't know? Um, you will probably find this out eventually if you hang out with her enough, but uh, she falls frequently. Oh, really? She's not, yeah, she's not, she's not among the most graceful people. I mean, she's awesome. <laughs> Love her to death, of course. But um, it, it is not uncommon to witness her just completely spill and fall. She, she was on her way home from, uh, from the movie, actually, by herself, and she was at the airport carrying all these bags, and she fell flat on her face, and she was all alone, so nobody was able to help her out. Nobody stopped to help her. Like, it was just, it was a, yeah, she told me about it. She was, it was, it was an awful, awful scene, but um, that's not unusual, and she did admit it, too. Yeah. So this movie takes place in detention, or I guess everyone meets in detention. Right. Have you ever been in detention? I, you know, I don't think so. I don't I, think so either. I'm, a, I'm, an, I'm an unusually, I'm an unusual case. I don't even think I ever got grounded. Is that weird? I don't think, I don't think so. No, I mean, I, I, yeah, I have no recollection of that, which is kind of embarrassing in a way, because, I mean, I, how good of a kid can you be? But I don't think I ever got grounded. I maybe got, like, talked to after class. Yeah. But that was usually just for arguing with the teacher. Oh, if you were going to play a practical joke, though, what would it be? Oh, oh, oh. One of my favorite, like, senior pranks that, that happened at my school was they covered all the door handles in, like, Vaseline. So they couldn't, nobody could open the doors. It was pretty, it was, you know, low-key, but it was, it was still, it got the job done. That's pretty gnarly. Yeah. Well, thank you so much. It was very nice sure. to meet you. Nice to meet you. Have fun in there.